Hey, welcome back. I am today, I need to make two things out of chamomile flowers. I did have to order it dried. I've planted it the last two years and the grasshoppers keep eating my plant. So, um, let me get a glove here. Alright, so what I'm going to do, and I know, you know, that to make a tincture, it's better to have fresh, but I'm just going to leave it in uh, 8 to 10 weeks instead of 4 to 6 weeks. So, I think that might be a little bit too much. So I'm just going to put it in this jar about three-fourths full. You, making tinctures is so easy. Um, so, and then I'm going to cover it all the way to the brim, all the way to the rim with vodka. This is 100 proof. Vodka, which is 50% uh, water, 50% alcohol. So you want to fill it all the way to the rim so that there's no air and that way it doesn't oxidize and go bad on you. So this is my chamomile tincture. Before I put it in my cool dark place, I will put a label on it with what it is, where I got it from, and when it will be ready. So in eight to 10 weeks, this will be ready. Um, to strain off. So the next project that I'm going to do with this is I developed a rash. Let me get my funnel. I developed a rash on the inside of my arm, upper arm, and on the inside of my thighs. And I've had it for a couple of months, maybe about six weeks. And I, I don't want that much in there. Um, I, ha I tried my calendula uh, salve that I have that's really good for skin issues. And it stops the itching on it, but it's not completely making it go away. So I heard that um, chamomile salve would actually take care of it. So I'm going to give it a try. Of course, you know, if I just set this on the shelf, it's going to take four to six weeks. So I think I'm going to put it in. I've got a little mini crock pot. And I'll put uh, a cloth down in the bottom so that the glass doesn't break. And I will just warm it on low for eight hours. And that will kind of make it infuse faster. But I am using avocado oil. It's the only thing that I use in my salves and in my cooking anymore. Because what I've been using for years and years and years... Come to find out that they use a chemical that covers up the um, smell of it being rancid. So I use avocado oil. Every once in a while I will buy um, 
olive oil, but I like the avocado oil because it doesn't really have a, uh, a taste to it when I cook. Okay, so I got a chopstick. I'm just kind of stirring that up, but I need to add more. I'm just going to make a small batch of this. Um, so that I can try it and see. Because I really don't want to waste my chamomile because I love chamomile tea. So. Alrighty. So with that, I will close this out and I will come back and let you know uh, and in another video if it actually worked for me. So, I hope you have a good day and we will see you on the next thing I'm doing. Bye.